Sometimes I just sneak the meatballs themselves and I sprinkle a little bit of cheese on them. I'm low carb, so. <laughs> we were gonna start a little cafe downtown Greenville. Met these guys and said, hey, let's build a food truck instead. Let, that way we can go with the owner of the truck when she goes to college. We built this from a box truck and there was basically nothing in it and we kind of built it from the ground up. Everyone knows what Area 51 is. Nobody knows what's inside of it. Same thing with the truck. Everybody gets excited, but nobody knows what it's there until we get there. Yeah. Can you grab mozzarella sticks? So my role in the business is like scheduling, book work, pretty much everything from home. Uh, before I came to the college, I used to work the window every night. Uh, so I did customer service, uh, I did baking, I did cooking, I did prep work. I was going into the you know, stores and shopping for food and loading the truck and unloading the truck and you know, working 12 hour shifts. And I've pretty much started kind of doing the work from home and then the rest of my time is dedicated to uh, my schoolwork. I visited the first time in um, 2016 and I did a tour of the campus and I pretty much fell in love with downtown Charleston. Well, the College of Charleston has really helped me learn how to communicate, which has also helped the business. And it's because, you know, you're talking to your professors a lot, you're talking to other students a lot, you're having to interact with people in group situations. And you know, if you do any sort of extracurricular activities, you have to interact with people too.